on account of me being a respected member of the community and such. Oh, is it loud? I just realized, I was just looking at the levels and I was like, whoa. Is that better? My bad. I turned it up to listen to the music. <laughs> looking forward to working with you. Of course, this will probably be the last time you ever see me since there ain't no sinner or nothing. <gasps> Guys, that is actually foreshadowing. You can build him a place here. Amber Lily, thank you for the eight months. So it says here you quit without saving last time you played. Care to explain yourself? What? No, I didn't. Wait, was I testing something? I might have been testing something. Uh-oh. Oh, a do-over, huh? Something didn't quite go your way, is that the deal? Well, I guess that's one way to play it. But don't you think that just maybe it'd be more rewarding to roll with them punches you're taking? That's definitely how I'd most likely recommend you play the game. Don't you want to do the right thing and save? For the kids? For the whales? Come on, save the whales! Were you were expecting something a little different? Here's the thing. The Reset Surveillance Center? It don't exist no more. When they were drawing up the town budget for this fiscal year, folks were all like, what's wrong with a little reset every now and then? We don't got the funds for this nonsense. Blah, blah, and so on and so forth. So you see, I ain't here on official business or nothing. I'm just volunteering this once. So next time you reset, I ain't gonna pop out. This is it. All reset, he's out. Of course, if you were to use your mayoral powers to restore the center, that'd be different. And if it should come to pass, I'll be back on the job in full force. Unstoppable mole power. <laughs> but listen to me. Run in my trap like a fancy pirate or something. Good luck with all your future endeavors. Take care now, and bye bye Okay, Isabella, I don't remember not doing that. I haven't seen you around lately. How long have I been gone? I feel like it hasn't been- What happened? What did I do? Oh, dude, my outfit looks so good! Wait! Oh no! My flowers! They're dead! We have to save them! What did I get? Oh, from Gulliver? Oh, I did close without saving. <laughs> <laughs> okay, hold on. It is my fault because I've seen this before. <laughs> I didn't save because I wanted you guys to see it. Oh no, the thing's still messed up. Okay, I think that's fine. Oopsies. It was my bad, y'all. Um, it's my mom. I can't help but be a little nervous about your first solo journey. I'm sending you something to help you along. What? What'd we get? Gulliver sent us a mermaid statue. Ain't that the best thing you ever heard in your life? A glass top table? Wait, what's this? Flower wreath. Oh, I don't have any walls. <laughs> I can't put it up. Money? Wait. Welcome to my amazing house, everyone. Uh, I don't have much money because I keep spending it all. Let's put down my glass table. 
Oh! And then my mermaid statue as well. Whoa. She's nudie. You know what we could do? Maybe? Uh... I didn't want to pick up the coin. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> okay! That one does not go on the table. In that case, um... You know what I can do? I might block the statue, though. It does block the statue. I'll move the statue here. Yeah! Woo! Okay. Oh, wait! Skirt! Funky dot... No. I want... I want to sell that. I don't like that. LED, I think of the 33 months. Jules, thank you for the 22. Lemonade Fox, thank you for the 31. Chloe, thank you for the 40. I've seen the Mean Girls movie tomorrow. Have you? I've not seen it. You're gonna have to let me know if it was good. Who's seen the Mean Girls movie, the new one? <gasps> I forgot Rosie lives there. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Wait, have they always lived here? I feel like some new people moved in. Wait, hold on, why do we have so many houses? Okay, Lucky's here, right? We knew that one. Oh God, I got, I need to build a bridge so bad. Live! I keep getting a whiff of my perfume. Dude, I smell, I smell amazing. Who's this? Del Taco, free Shavakadu. I remember that one. <gasps> Live! How long was I gone? I really thought that I was only gone for like a week. Maybe they think that's a long time. What perfume? I must be wearing like three right now. <laughs> Well, I did a Scentbird sponsorship, which is probably one of my favorite sponsorships I've ever done, because I love perfume. And I have them all sitting right here still, actually. The Versace one is my favorite. The Crystal Noir EDT. It is so yummy, dude. Dude, how are there so many weeds? I was not gone that long, I swear. I have so many freaking weeds! Are you okay? <laughs> Are you stuck? Oh no, you're good. So smart. So we actually did get Gale. I mean, the luck is out. It's unreal. It's unreal. Wait, did we have her before? No. Wait. No, did we? I actually can't remember. Oh, I guess we did. I feel like I haven't talked to you in a long time. Did I forget? I thought Gail was new. Oh. She calls me snacky. Where did you decide to build your house? Uh, way over yonder. So far away? I'll have to come over for a visit. It sounds exciting. I should send you a letter. Okay. 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 Bye. She is so cute. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Oh, I have the mod vanilla. I have both of the ones. The mod, what's it called? Blush? The pink one. And the vanilla one. I think I prefer, I like both. Both are fantastic. But I think I like the blush one, just like the slightest bit more. 
But I'm such a vanilla bitch. Like, I just love the smell of it. It's my fave, personally. Oh, dude. All my flowers are like dead. What happened? I swear to you, I wasn't gone that long. Look, another one. Three. Three. Trent, thank you for the three months. What's going on here? Oh, fishing tourney results. Yeah, I definitely wasn't there for that. When was that? Oh, oh, maybe it has been a while. I thought I played this like two days ago. Yeah. I, I'm i gonna be honest, all of Ariana's perfumes that I've tried have been very good. I haven't tried all of them though. Um, the cloud one is really good. I wore that one for a long time. I still have it. I think it's very good. Just getting my fossils. It's my daily thing. I gotta do it. <laughs> Cloud is my main bitch. Is Moonlight? Is that Ariana? I haven't had that one. I will say I'm definitely missing the tool ring right about now. Oh, guys, I have been playing my mermaid Animal Crossing Island off camera. And, ooh, perfect peaches. And I'm, for some reason, I'm struggling to get three stars. I don't know what's going on. Who's moving here? That just sounds like somebody I don't like. Not to be rude. But I think I already don't like them. I'm missing a fossil. Where haven't I looked? Oh, I didn't go behind my house. I bet it's over there. Are you ladies dumb chattering? Let's talk about where a manly man can get some cologne. <laughs> Sephora. <laughs> Thank you, Chance, for the 500 bits. <laughs> oh, well, my little apples grew in. It's not over here either. You hate to see it. I wonder where it is. Nobody say a freaking word. Nobody say anything. I don't want to hear it. Have you guys encountered any Sephora kids? I keep hearing these like really scary stories on TikTok. Oh my God, I did it again. But I don't go into Sephora enough. It's bad, wait, you've seen them IRL? Wait, really? They're so mean, I'm running into you. Wait, what do you mean? The stories are true? There's Ulta kids too? Oh my god, nowhere is safe. I really need an axe, dude. There are too many trees in this town. Ulta's just as bad. I guess because I like order everything, I never actually see anybody in person. I live in France and I saw them too. Even France isn't safe? Oh, there it is. They made it all the way to France, y'all. Wait, I can't believe like they're- So I saw this TikTok of this- Okay, I saw this TikTok of this girl who went to Sephora and she was getting like, 
I think it was Dior or something, like a lip gloss. This is like, this would be expensive, right? It's Dior. And she, it was the last one. And she picked it up and she was like, oh, thank God I found it. Like, I'm so happy. And this little girl like runs up, like run, like sprints at her. And was like, what did you just pick up? And she, and she told her, and she's like, is there another one up there? And she's like, oh no, I'm so sorry. I think I took the last one. And she goes, well, give it to me. Like, as if it was like, like a, like a duh situation. And she said, no. And then, um, she kicked her on the back of the leg and made her bleed with her little Ugg boot and then threw her Stanley cup at her. She showed a picture of her ankle, it was like bleeding. I was like, these things weigh like 20 pounds. She had, um, no, she had video evidence. She was like recording a little bit of it. She wasn't like recording the child, but like she had her phone like down here. I believe it. I don't know. I've heard enough stories at this point. But anyway, she said that the dad actually came up to her and shockingly was like really apologetic um, and nice about it. But I mean, someone could have pressed charges for that. I don't know. It's crazy, but it's like, um, what's, what's weird to me is that this stuff is like really expensive. Like, it's not like they're fighting over flip phone lip glosses. They're fighting over Chanel and Dior. Whose parents are buying their 12 year old Dior? If I would have asked my mom for Dior, she would have laughed in my face and then took me out of the store. It would have been embarrassing for me to even ask. She'd have been like, are you out of your mind? Mm, are you cuckoo? Are you cuckoo crazy? Have you smacked your head on the pavement? Am I missing a tool? Mm. Oh no, I'm holding it. Have <laughs> Vaseline? No, seriously. She'd be like, have some Aquaphor. <laughs> and you know what? And I still use it. Is this closed? It's 9 a.m.? Oh. Well, now I have nothing to sell. <gasps> He's not open either? 10 a.m. They open late. What is that in the back? for how how crazy is it in the bathroom where you need handlebars on your toilet <laughs> i think i need to talk to isabel oh wait i'm supposed to be doing like a um approval rating right now oh stop running through the freaking flowers you idiot Two words, Taco Bell. Well, you got me there. Man, thank you for the 25 months. Do I go back here? I'm fighting demons in there. It didn't look like a toilet. It definitely looked, I thought it was like a, um, one of those like rocking sort of toys. 
um, that are like shaped like animals. I guess it is the, the handlebars. I don't know what they're called. Like ones that you would see at like a playground or something. But like a toy. Yeah, kind of like a rocking horse. That's what I thought it was. I was not expecting you to say potty with the springs. Please, that's my brother. I don't let him into my room for just this reason. I was going to tell you about the town hall. The area where I usually stand is a service counter. Um, okay. Okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Moving on to your responsibilities as mayo. So your responsibilities as mayonnaise are as follows. Be gross. And that's all. Before you can start laying out your vision for jelly, you'll need a town development permit. Oh, I haven't even started on this. <laughs> Getting the permit takes a lot of work, a bit of work, but don't worry, I'll help you out. Ooh, we got rice, yummy. I've been having so much freaking Chipotle. Because it's like one of the only things I can eat. <laughs> I've just been having so much of it. I just love your can-do attitude. Your mayoral instincts must be really good because you're already sitting in the mayor's chair. Um, okay. I'm gonna get right back in the chair, girl. You'd like to work on the application for your town development permit. Well, then let me explain the prerequisites for the permit. The first requirement is that you own a house. You're still living in a tent, so you'll need to put together the down payment for a house first. Oh my god, my eye itches. The second requirement for the town development permit is to gain the approval of the citizens. In order to gauge citizen approval, I'll regularly survey the townsfolk to see what they think of you. The best way to raise your approval rating... <sighs> is to improve the town. <laughs> Sorry, the boat's taken off. Uh, is to improve the town and the lives of those who live here. There, here. Now, according to a preliminary survey, your current approval rating is at 24%. Let's go. <laughs> you have 100%. <laughs> Did you guys see the TikTok of the new like Disney cruise line and the, the horn got stuck and it kept going, <laughs> over again at like 2 a.m. and no one can sleep. Did you guys see this? I have no idea if it was real or not, but it was so freaking funny. It was playing like When You Wish Upon a Star, but over and over again. And it was like a boat horn. Can you play it? Let's see if I can find it. TikTok. Oh, I posted a, a TikTok and an Instagram reel today. It was me decorating my Kindle. Um, Disney porn. Okay, here we go. Okay, <laughs> I found it. Thirty in the morning, and the horn on this Disney cruise will not stop. Wait, they're making an announcement. Ladies and gentlemen, we are currently experiencing an issue with the ship's horn. Our maintenance crew is trying to resolve the issue. We thank you for your patience. This is one of three. I found these in my suitcase. Guys, it is not blocking out the noise. It is so. I have no idea this is real or not, but it's so funny. <laughs> what are they even saying? Our team expects that the issue will be resolved in about 45 minutes to an hour. I apologize if your plans might have been interrupted. Two in the morning. Two in the morning. I have to call the Disney Wish because they bought it on Wish.com. It is 1.30 in the morning. <laughs> I did, hold on, hold on, hold on. I did see this. Uh, 
This one's loud. This was last year. Last June. That was really loud. <laughs> oh my gosh, it's playing two at the same time. <laughs> issues guys she said whoops <laughs> come on oh my goodness it's playing to that one was kind of beautiful time. i thought that one was guys, really nice this is a disney wish uh, here at port canaveral having some heart <laughs> first one the guy in the dark i have no idea if that's real but it's pretty funny either way either way it had me cracking up on the toilet excuse me wait what a kind of like oh i saw it oh these are my patterns well, you know what? Let's change the flag. It's just you, the rose. It's Brittany, bitch. <gasps> Hello, Zeus. Thank you for the raid. Wait, you also ended stream early today, too. Are you sick again? Thank you, Ellie, for the 25 months. Doop, doop, a doop, doop, a doop. Wait, did I did ask something, yes. I asked why uh why the short stream again, if you're still sick or not. Oh, can I not change the flag? I wasn't listening. Oh, I think I already did it. I'm so dumb. I just ran it for a long time, so I'm exhausted. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm getting old. Don't we know it? Just kidding. <laughs> no, not, not yeah, you look it. Uh, Simjin, S-Man. Thank you guys for the subs as well. What is this Bob hairstyle? Hey. It's the default one, okay? Okay, I haven't been able to change it yet. Cookie Girl, thank you for the three months. He got upset over Interstellar. Upset? But Interstellar is like his whole life. Like if he could choose me versus watching Interstellar, it would be Interstellar. Reading critic reviews on Rotten Tomatoes. <laughs> oh God. I actually kind of wish I was there. Some people are literal idiots. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what were they saying? Critic Zeus reviews? What'd they say? What were, what were they saying? I'm looking up some town tunes, by the way. I don't know what, I don't know what we're gonna do. I'm just looking something up. Dancing Queen from ABBA, Skater Boy. Half of them said you needed to be smart to watch it. Half of them said it was inaccurate. Inaccurate to what? What are they comparing it to? I 
I just watched Kiki's delivery service yesterday. Interstellar, though ambitious and thrilling at points, is too complicated and doesn't reach its full potential. Oh, I just know that set you off. <laughs> Y'all don't understand how much this man talks about Interstellar. Literally, all the time. All the time. There are many words to describe Interstellar. Entertainment isn't one of them. <laughs> oh, shit. Dang. <laughs> That's messed up. SpongeBob theme. Hold up. Can I move it like this? <gasps> I should do a SpongeBob theme on my other island. It's under the water. Actually, I made my town tune on the other one. Under the sea. But I could also do SpongeBob. That would also work. I have no idea how this is gonna sound, like, at all. Well, I'm sorry that Zeus, uh, or I'm sorry to Zeus, that people were not being nice. I was in the wrong key there. I keep getting away from my perfume, and I smell insanely good. Let's see what that sounds like. Let me crank it for you guys. That's so good! But I love it! Wow. She sounded a, a, quite amazing. Very different from New Horizons. Okay, ready? Let's see if we hear it. I heard it. Okay. Where are all of my villagers? <laughs> I haven't seen them literally anywhere. Except for Gail, who is in her house. Where are they? I, I mean, I went around this entire town looking for fossils and I didn't see anyone. Oh, except for you. But you're not a villager. But they're not in their houses. So where are they? They wouldn't be in here, would they? I don't know where they are. I cannot find them. <gasps> I wonder if they're sleeping. Because it's 9 a.m.? Oh my god, I bet they're sleeping. What do you got? What's this little outfit? He's got a tent! He's got a tent! Do you have Wi-Fi? Hey. Harv. Oh, you mean me. How do we know each other? Aren't those little yellow birds cute? What are you on? Let's see. Thank you for the 47 months. I've been trapped in Sasha's basement for basement for four years. Well, get comfortable. Look at you! He just sang it. That's so cute. What do we got? Some jungle stuff. Oh. Ooh. Oh my God! Those birds are alive. Nah, I'm okay. That's true, I don't have a basement. That's a good point. Texas doesn't have basements because we flood. Oh, th that was scary. I actually really wish we had basements. I think basements are like, so cool. Cause they're soundproof and you basically get a third house. Like if you have two stories already, that's your, like a basement's literally a third house. It's like the size of your house. Okay, let me go to someone's house and see what it says. Yeah, if you have two stories. I'm sleeping! 
I knew it. Oh man, I'm so alone out here. I got no reactions or anything. I can't even be sad. Now what? <laughs> I'm alone. I can try to fish. It's gonna go terribly wrong though. Let's see. Let's give it a go. Hey, I got it. It would be so nice for something like this, like a, um, like if you were like a YouTuber <laughs> or a streamer, having your like office in the basement would be nice because it'd be really soundproof. new. Take that one to the bank. By the bank, I mean the museum. Wouldn't the Wi-Fi be trash though? In the basement? I don't know. I, I don't know. I guess it depends on your like signal. Oh, another new one. Oh, yee -hee. okay. I'm finding so many new fishies. I'm kind of slaying right now. Oh, 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 big one, big one. No, 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 stop. Come on. Don't, you little. Not new, but that's fine. That's actually good because I can sell it. I also need to go look for shells and stuff. I just need to make a little bit of cash so I can try to pay off my house. There's that's that's I swear it's the same fish every time. There's one fish that I cannot catch with this lag. It's like you have to click it really fast. My guess is that it's like a piranha or something. Oh, I got that one. Swagger Brownie, thank you for the five months. I don't know, I just think the the idea of a basement is like so nice. I used to think it was scary, but I mean, I think they can be scary, but not if you like make them look like a house. Oh my God, wait, this thing is on the freaking move. PB13, thank you for the PB. <laughs> Peanut butter 13, PG13, thank you for the five months. <laughs> Unfinished storage basins are scary. Yes. I've seen some really nice um, basements though. Like on TikTok and stuff. Mm, I want one. My dog refuses to go to the basement. Why? Haunted? I want Pete Davidson's basement? Is that code for something? We think his original owners locked him in a basement. That is devastating to hear. That is literally the saddest thing I've ever heard in my life. And you wanna know something crazy? I literally am the worst mom ever because earlier today I had furniture delivered and I had to put, I just like put Yuna in my like, one of the rooms downstairs. Um, and I left her in there. It had only been an hour, okay? An hour went by and I kept thinking, she's awfully quiet. She's awfully quiet down there. And as soon as I walked downstairs, it hit me that I, she was still in there. And I go, <gasps> I was like, no! And I immediately, I open the door and she's like all excited to see me. I showered her 
with treats and loving. I let her go outside and run around in the mud. I was like, I'm so sorry. It wasn't that long, like thankfully, but I felt so bad. I was like, oh my God. I felt horrible. Yeah, she was definitely just asleep the whole time. Like, no doubt, but I still felt bad. <gasps> hey, you're awake. What do you mean? How long have I been gone? I felt so bad, dude. I've done that to my cats too. It happens, but I just feel so bad. It's like when you accidentally like step on your dog's foot or something. And then you're like, how do I make them realize how sorry I am? Like, how do I tell them? They don't understand. How do I make it up to them? <laughs> no, Chloe. They do understand. Well, they better. They pro I've only probably stepped on Yuna's foot like twice, but every single time I'm like, I'm like, here, take three treats. Do you want to get a new toy? Do you want to jump? Do you want to go for like a walk or something? <laughs> I'll give her anything she wants. I'm like, how do I make you know that I'm so sorry? Good morning, everyone's waking up. Okay, I get it. Apparently I haven't been here in a while. I'm looking pretty cool today, huh? I actually don't know if that would work. It worked. <laughs> Ask me where that photo went. I don't know. Well, you know what? Oh, man, I need, I need two bridges so bad. I need one over here so I can get to um, retail faster. And I need one on the other side so I can get to my house faster. Like, I need them so bad, dude. Okay, I'm actually gonna run to the beach and pick up some like shells and stuff just so I can sell them. If I'm gonna do one big selling moment, I might as well have a bunch of stuff. Can we go to Tortimer's Island yet? Uh, I really wanna go there. We can get so much stuff there. It's actually like a freaking life hack in the winter cause it's summer over there. My pockets are full. Yes, they give it 47 months. Oh my gosh, so, <laughs> so many mods are resubbing today. I'm gonna put some of this stuff away. I have to make sure I don't sell any fish that I need to donate though. Where was that fish? It's resub day. There are no, there's no crafting in this game. So no recipes. It has a... I'll swap it. Oh, do I have to pay off my loan first for Tortimer's Island? Yeah, cause then we can go do a bunch of mini games and then get all the mermaid furniture. It is so fun. But yeah, it's always summer over there. So, um, which one, which one of these things are new? That's new. And I, I don't remember. I'm just going to go to the museum first. I don't remember. Yeah, the mini games are super fun. I think I might be able to get all the fruit there too. Because obviously I'm not doing any online features, seeing as that's not really even a thing anymore. And I don't even know where I would do it anyways. Uh, museum. What 
time is it in the game? Oh, 30 more minutes and the stores will open. I can also just time travel. But it's so difficult. Maybe the store should just stay closed because I can't help myself. I keep buying stuff. I have a problem. Okay, it was these two. Doop, doop, doop. Mm, no, I'm good, thank you. Bye bye, blathers, bye bye. Dude, I look so good with my glasses. <laughs> I love these things. And that's they give it 30 months. Dude, look how cute my freaking glasses are. I actually really like my little haircut. I think I look good. My little bow. Street pass in this game was so fun. Oh, careful, girl. <laughs> I already destroyed one. Careful. Was there a way to unlock more custom design slots in this game? Or did you just have to make a new character? Oh, Claudia's new? Sorry, girl, I ain't never even met you yet. Dude, okay, I've been losing my freaking mind over Nintendo this past week. Because there was a bunch of rumors that they were going to have a Nintendo Direct announced this week. And that it was going to be this week. And so all week I've like got my freaking eyes peeled. And nothing. And then I see today that there's reports that uh, the Nintendo Switch 2 or whatever has been um, delayed to next year. According to sources. I don't know. And I was like, my eyes started twitching. Cause that means that Animal Crossing will be delayed to next year. And I'm like, you guys have got to actually, you, I, I don't know if that's true or not. Okay, take it with a grain of salt. I did hear it from unknown sources, which is just the internet. <laughs> so that could be wrong, but I hope, I hope it's wrong. Cause I really want a new Animal Crossing. Which is funny because um, it does kind of seem like New Horizons just came out. But New Horizons came out almost four years ago. Four years ago. Isn't that kind of weird? I was just calculating how old I was when it came out. I don't even want to say. Also, I don't want to encourage age chat. <laughs> Lily will literally shut shut it all down. <laughs> but yeah, anyways, four years ago, which is crazy. Age old. <laughs> okay, is this the only fish in the ocean? Can I get another one? No, not a balloon. I can't catch it. You know what? I'm pretty sure in this game, the balloons only have balloon furniture. Which is cute, but... I don't want it. Damn it. This is why I can only catch one fish. Oh, wait, there's a big one over there. I really feel like I lost three years thanks to COVID. I still feel like the age I was when it started. I totally agree. And maybe that's why it feels so weird that Animal Crossing is as old as it is, because it came out 
right when COVID started, really. <gasps> oh, dude, its eyes are crazy. <laughs> new fish, new fish. <gasps> swap it. Just swap it with a shell. No. I almost pressed quit. That was so scary. What is this big freaking fish? Hmm. That's just gonna happen, I guess. I can't help but wonder if there's gonna be some fish I'm not gonna be able to catch though. Because of the input lag. Which is kind of annoying. What was the new fish I just I caught an olive flounder. That's the only one I cannot sell. Don't sell that one. But it's interesting because in between, um, like pretty much every single Animal Crossing was about four years. And then there was a really, really big gap between this one and New Horizons because they skipped the Wii U. Because it was bad. <gasps> I have enough for my loan. Yay! Okay. Let's gotta wait for Tom Nook to wake up. So, technically, this would be around the, the time that it's like they're due for a new one. I have a feeling though that we're not gonna get that lucky. I don't know. Maybe I've just been burned. <laughs> I've been burned dirt. Okay, what? I've been burned one too many times. Okay. Mm We don't count that one game we don't speak of. <laughs> no, we don't. We so I never even played it. And I have no desire to either. There was one spinoff game. And it was kind of like Mario Party, but with Animal Crossing, which like sounds cute, but like when you're waiting for a new Animal Crossing game to come out and you get that instead, you're like, what the hell? <laughs> like literally what even is this? I think, it, I believe it's called Animal Crossing Amiibo Festival. Oh, and then they had Pocket Camp, which I mean, I did play when it came out because I was like, oh, that's cute. But it's not an Animal Crossing game. It's just Animal Crossing characters. It's cute. It's a cute game. I think Pocket Camp is cute. Like, for a mobile game, like, it's a cute concept. I like it. But... It, it requires you to spend, like, so much real money. Um, and I'm not a huge fan of that. Personally, I just think that, and I feel this way with The Sims as well, the perfect Animal Crossing game is just literally a mix of this one and New Horizons. Perfection. And it's the same thing with The Sims. I literally think the perfect Sims game is a mix between like The Sims 3 and The Sims 4. Personally. That's my own opinion, of course, but. How much time until this opens? 20 minutes? Are you crazy? I'm not waiting that long. <laughs> I'm just gonna fast forward. Well, I think that um, the characters sort of lost the plot a little bit. I mean, what makes Animal Crossing Animal Crossing, it's literally in the name. It's the animals, like your villagers. And the villagers literally have 
no point in New Horizons. They are quite literally just for aesthetic purposes. And that seems like a reoccurring theme in New Horizons is that pretty much everything is only for aesthetic purposes. There's no progression, really. There's nothing to work towards. Um, it's all, it's very sandboxy. Like it's pretty much just up to you to just make it fun. Which is like fine, but it's missing a lot of what um, makes Animal Crossing a really, really fun game. I also get overwhelmed by too much freedom. And you know what? This is a crazy opinion to have. But I almost kind of want the... Oh no, I got I got sneeze. I almost kind of prefer when... The like shops are not in the town. Like here they have them on Main Street. And I like that. However, 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 if that were to be the case again, I would love for there to be some customization with that. Being able to change like the exterior of the buildings, maybe by doing certain tasks or whatever, and then you eventually unlock that. Like, I think that's really cool. Like, there's ways to, like, customize the way that the train station looks and, like, town hall. But you have to, like, meet certain requirements before you can do that. And it, like, takes a while. Um, but it's, like, a really good determining factor of how long someone has been playing in their town and how much progress they've made. And I think that's cool. Little stuff like that. Like, being able to customize the outside of these and also having more... Uh, stores be upgradable. So instead of just this one, what if like Able Sisters could upgrade? You know? What if his Nook store, his home store could upgrade? Maybe you could unlock different customization options later down the line and stuff like that. I don't know. I love a good upgrade. I love a good upgrade. I want to upgrade stuff forever. Don't take that away from me. Down payment. Here you go. <gasps> Color of the roof! It's blue. Because my nails are blue. Yeah, I just think that, um... I think it's really cool to have goals in games, like something to work towards. That's why I like doing um, challenges in, Anna, er, in um, The Sims. Yay! We're gonna have a house! Whee! All right, let's go see what's in the shops. Not this one, we already know. Similar to rags to riches, yes. And I think that that would incentivize, you know, people like me who like to start over a lot to not because you wouldn't be able to upgrade things, you know, to their fullest extent without spending like a little bit of time. Wait, this dress is cute. What is that? Prim outfit. It's cute, but it's not as cute as my outfit. Nah, I don't want it. Why do we look like a pinata threw up on us? It's called Fashion Chance. Learn about it. <laughs> Ooh, a blue bow. I don't want to spend money on that, but is this a beret? Oh, wee wee. <laughs> Makes my hair look. <laughs> no, I don't want that. Dude, nothing could beat what I have on right now. Maybe except for this. <laughs> it 
it did kind of look like an acorn. <laughs> uh, no, we're good. I'll just sell it to him in here. It's fine. You can change your hair, but you have to unlock Shampoodle. So in order to get this shop upgraded, it's kind of like New Horizons where you have to spend a certain amount of money and a certain amount of time has to pass. Have I never sold him anything? That's crazy. I'm literally gonna sell one fish. <laughs> I don't even think I can afford anything in here. I'm poor. Tom Nook took all my money. In New Horizons, we lost Brewster for a time. Cap'n, for a time. Cap'n's wife and daughter, Rossetti. Uh, Tortimer. Dr. Shrunk, Wendell. Wendell is in the, uh, DLC, but he doesn't really do too much. Um... Joan, Nat, Chip, Pelly, Phyllis, Digby, Lyle, Lottie, unless you have, yeah, but does he have DLC? Yeah, that's true. A lot of people are gone. I just think, um, yeah, no, I think they need to bring it back. <laughs> I think that like, okay, here's, here's what I think happened. I think that they wanted to focus on really, cause obviously in this game, this was the first time that they really experimented with letting you decorate your town, right? Now, obviously, it's not as intuitive as in New Horizons where you can just throw any old thing on the ground. Um, you have to, like, really work for it in this in this town. Um, but I think they really wanted to expand on that. And so that's what they were purely focused on was, like, all of the town building aspects, which is great. And I don't think that they should remove that in the next game. I think that now that we've had that, I think that going back on that would actually piss a lot of people off. Um, I do think that they should keep it, but they, they are missing. Oh my God, Gracie. Not long ago, I was so tired that I accidentally fell asleep without saving. When I woke up, I didn't remember a thing from the day before. I get it, okay? I left without saving! Sue me! I already got it. I heard it from freaking Rossetti earlier. Is anybody else awake? Oh, hello. You're freaking scary. I think I need to swap out my old circle banner for a new piece that's similar but different. If you come across anything that's cool, that's the same size as my old piece, let me know. What the hell's a circle banner? New circle banner. Oh. It's quite tall. I think that castle thing would probably work at the shop, but I do not have enough money for all that. Back to the beach. To the beach each. Actually, once we have Tortimer's Island, we're gonna have a lot of money. Our mermaid statue. <gasps> I can't give up my mermaid statue. I'm attached to it. We have a connection. How's the gluten-free restriction going? It's actually going pretty good. I found some stuff that I like. Uh, it's just a little annoying trying to eat out places. That's the only thing that's annoying. Other than that though, not bad. Doable. I also have gluten-free chicken nuggets. They're pretty good. They're yummy. They taste like normal chicken nuggets. Is it helping? I don't know. I won't know until I have more blood work done, which is super fun. Ow. And that won't be for a while. So I don't know. We'll figure it out. 
figure it out later. For now, I'm just gonna keep it on going. You know what? I actually think I have a couple of gluten-free nuggets left downstairs. I should eat them. Also have some waffles left. Gluten-free waffles taste exactly like normal waffles. Let me tell you some. I couldn't tell you the difference. It tastes exactly the same. I'm so scared I'm keeping my eyes open. Don't hit the button. Okay. <laughs> Especially once you toast. Once you toast a gluten-free waffle, it, I cannot... What's the difference? Should I make chicken nuggets and waffles? Chicken and waffles! Mmm. Yum. That's actually hilarious. Chicken nuggets and waffles. She was so close. <laughs> she was so close. She almost had it right. <laughs> uh, I'd love to play more Nancy Drew. I have it as my sub goal right now. Um, when we hit it, we'll play another one. That's girl dinner. No, literally it is. <laughs> I love this SpongeBob song. It's so cute. Who lives in the pineapple under the sea? Ah! SpongeBob Square Pants. Oh my God, Rich. I'm rich! Nobody talk to me. I'm too rich for any of you. Get out of my sight, peasant. Make a nugget burrito. Put nuggets on the waffle and wrap it up and eat like a burrito! Wait, that actually kind of tastes good, I bet. It's a crazy thing to eat, but I bet it would taste good. And then dip it in syrup. No, I can't eat that. I feel sick. But it would probably taste really good. <laughs> they did do Reese and Cyrus so dirty. I will admit though, I do prefer having just like one place to sell stuff that like pays like one price rather than having to like run all the way out over to retail. This chicken actually tastes good with syrup. I actually, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know. Um, you know what does though? Bacon. If you've ever had like a plate of breakfast food and like your maple syrup sort of like seeps into your bacon, it is so good. Oh. It's so good. I only like bacon if, what is that? It's glowing. Three. Simon, thank you for the three months. Anxiety, thank you for the 29 as well. Yeah, I, I really like the idea of doing like another main street sort of vibe. I like the idea. I think it would be cool to be able to customize Main Street though. Cause I think that's the one annoying factor about New Leaf is that if you were to visit someone's town and go to their Main Street, it would look exactly like yours. And it's cool in New Horizons how you can sort of put your shops anywhere. Like that's a cool feature. Oh, oh okay. But it can also be really overwhelming. Just sort of depends on how you like to play. I do think though that that's why I never finish an island is because I just get too overwhelmed. It happens a lot. Like with, um... Girl, don't do it! Don't do it! You stay up there. Turn around. 
I saved the day. <laughs> sea bass. Sea ass. What? Oops. I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I was just thinking about it. I don't want to go and do it. <laughs> it's because I haven't bought any freaking carpets from them. Ladies and gentlemen, the that literally scared me so bad. Thank you, Jackson! And look, I caught a new fish! Thank you for the five gifted! That is very nice of you. Thank you. I need to get a new alert for that. That's a little outdated now. I really want some new alerts, like some new alert sounds. I've just had the same ones for so long. I seem to shake it up every once in a while, but I have no idea what to do. Open the door. <laughs> I think that's Zeus's. Disney Cruise honking. <laughs> That's so funny. What a funny thing to malfunction. Stop messing with that. That was a good impression, you have to admit. It sounded just like him. <laughs> Open the door. Wait, that's our <laughs> that would be such a good raid message. Open the door or I'm gonna throw rocks through your window, you dumb whore. The TikTok you showed the other day of Widowilly. Oh <gasps> a squid! I Widowilly caught a squid! I squid willy just caught a squid. Calamari time! We're not gonna eat it! But if you and Zeus had different open the door variants as raid alerts, that would be hilarious. That is kind of funny, actually. I didn't even think about that. Like, same, same, but different. <laughs> Couple goals. <laughs> Don't lose this fish. <laughs> Matching alerts! <laughs> How do you guys do hearts? Do you do them like this? Do you do them like... I can't do this one very well. I just don't feel like that looks right to me. I'm still not very good at this one. What's the Gen Z heart? This one? I do this one. This is the millennial heart. Let's be honest. <laughs> Sucking water just wrapped her claws. I don't like, I feel like I can't do it very well. The second one, I mean. Don't do the Gen Z heart in Chicago, I beg of you. Why? Yeah, I can't, I can't do it. Gang sign? Wait, 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 hold on. This is a gang sign? For what? Chicago people hate love. If you do one of them. Oh, this? I probably shouldn't do it. I see people do this on TikTok every day. They're like, love you guys. 
Like that. Which actually makes it even worse. <laughs> Uh, I can't re- Oh, wait, no, that's new. That's new. All of Flounder's new. Have I gotten a dab before? Maybe. So <laughs> she's in a gang now. <laughs> yeah, guys, you know me. You don't want to mess with me. That actually would have been really funny if we did the the wish upon a star thing, because then it, it maybe would have sounded like the horns. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. People will be like filming themselves and they'll be like, yep. And that's all for today. Bye, guys. And they're like, you didn't even complete the heart. Something about it rubs me the wrong way. Like when people do this, I'm like, whatever. I just, I just don't personally do that heart. But like when they just do it one-sided, I'm like, my eye starts twitching. Da, da, da. <laughs> Bukali, wugali, that thing is juicy. <laughs> wugali! She, she went freaking rogue on that one, dude. <laughs> Thank you, Jackson, for the 500 bits. Oogly Oogly. <laughs> That's actually so funny. Why did you say it like that? Are these all new? I'm glad I didn't sell it. I was about to. I wonder if I can actually see what I've donated. I know I can see outside. Uh. Oh, it does not say donated. One bug. Interesting. <laughs> that voice is like if Kim Kardashian was a sim. <laughs> Oogly, woogly. That thing is juicy. <laughs> I feel like... Let me see how much that castle thing is so I can give it to Snake. Slimmy little slippy little snake. A rook! Oh, it's like a chess piece. That is a big chess piece? Are you freaking for real? <laughs> I thought it said rock. It's not just a boulder. It's a rock. The pioneers used to ride these babies for miles. No, Ron, no! I literally recited the whole script on the toilet the other day, just for fun, <laughs> just to myself. <laughs> No reason. Just popped into my head. <laughs> He's going to sacrifice himself. No, oh my god. Anyways. Where do you think this guy is? I saw him over here, but he could be anywhere now. I don't know where he lives. Oh, no. Oh! You like it? Oh, a rock! No. <laughs> oh, it actually worked! Reward time! What did I get? Guys, an actual rocking horse. Wait, what the heck? Hold on. Am I about to be terrified? What's going on? What? 
In tarnation? What am I supposed to be looking at? Uh oh. What? Ew. I f Ew, I finally just got like these scans that I did forever ago. Bro, what in tarnation am I looking at right now? Ew, they look scary. I don't know what I'm looking at, of course. Ew, I can't stand this. Why are there 52 images? I swear they took the same picture 30 times. Lexi could probably tell you. This is all my thyroid? All these photos? Oh, it's making me feel nauseous. No. Forget it, I ain't looking at that. Yeah, it was an ultrasound. Ugh! I thought that might be interesting, but I don't like, I don't, I don't like it. You know what? I saw a glimpse of the screen when they were taking those and I almost fainted. moved here mostly because of you. Are you surprised? What do you mean because of me? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for clapping. about me for a second and I was like guys I would simply never Arabian Nights yeah that's what I was playing alright let's see what this is or, well we know what it is what does it look like oh it's like a little toy Does this do anything? Do something, mermaid! Can I see your- Oh, we have a butt crack! Butt crack! I'm going to the next day. They have to take pictures of certain landmarks in your body and they take it from multiple angles to make sure they're not missing anything. Ew. It's the worst thing I've ever heard, I'm not gonna lie. I'm sick of the snow. There, I said it. I'm sick of it. My body is a landmark. <laughs> Shut up. You're like, my body is a temple. Bitch, <laughs> I'm a national park. <laughs> oh, what? Someone news moved into town. Oh yeah, Eugene. Oh, I have a house. Oh, wait, it's so cute. Now I can pick this up. My house so cute! My mom again? I remember how you used to hate broccoli because of the bitter taste. Have you outgrown that yet? What, did you send me broccoli in the mail? What's the- what's in the letter?
Molly, a shirt and half! That's a really good item! Hello, Isabel. I see your house is all finished. Congratulations. The lumber smell from a new house is so nice, isn't it? That reminds me, I brought over some wallpaper to celebrate your new home. Evil monkey, thank you for the 39 months. <sighs> I have to be the most obnoxious person in the room when I yawn. I don't know what it is. It's something within me. It's like I'm releasing my inner demons. I can't help it. I don't know what, like, I swear to God, I am like, my main goal in life is to blow up and then act like I don't know nobody. But then also to not be perceived at all. I don't want to be perceived. But then also, when I yawn, I must be the loudest person on earth. I have to do it. <gasps> oh, doesn't really match, but kinda. Pretty. I'm pretty sure I accidentally released a demon while letting out a burp today. I mean, like, it happens. Like, that's how they come out. Yawns, burps, maybe even a toot. <gasps> Pink rose sighting. Nope. <laughs> that was fast. I got confused with New Horizons. I'm about to get yelled at too. <laughs> I forgot you can just pick them up. <laughs> now I gotta listen to Isabel talk again. He may not pop up. Last time you left without saving the game. Okay, we said it doesn't pop up because he doesn't have his place built. Oh man, we haven't done nothing. All right, same thing. Thank God. Can you imagine if it was something different? I would, we don't need a shovel. Put that away. Rossetti, uh, he yelled at me once, but he said that he can't come out again because he doesn't have his house or his little like station built. When I build it, he'll return. <laughs> God, that quote from Gluon is alarming. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna speed past this one. <laughs> Life hack, never build it. I like building it, it's actually quite cute. Glue on would never hurt a fly. <laughs> okay, now, spread on floor. <gasps> I forgot about the wreath, actually. Let's just hang that right here in the center. Okay, it's beautiful. That's, I wouldn't say that's centered. Maybe if I like angle myself. So. Let's 
gonna leave. Saved. Okay, and all I was gonna do was move it right over here. Hold on, I actually need to grab... No. No. Yes. I don't think they go on the door. Pretty sure you can't have reeds in this game. Like, on the door, I mean. Anyone home? Oh! I go in, I go in. Oh, what are you leaving for Australia? Because Gluon's having his long 10-year stream anniversary next week, and I'm sure he'd love to play some games with you. I will be here next weekend! So I can definitely play some games. I'll let him know. It's super important that I have a little chat with Lucky, but I seriously can't get away right now. Would you like do me the hugest favor ever and bring him back here within an hour? Totes. That's so super awesome of you. Let me go get Lucky. You are still able to buy a new leaf. I'm like 99% sure. Looking for Lucky. Is this Lucky's house? It is, okay, he's not home. So, it's, I wish I had that freaking megaphone. I could just be like, Lucky. And he'd be like, I'm over here, babes. Oh! I came to get ya. Rosie wants to see me? Well, since you came all this way to pick me up, I'll go. But don't walk too fast. Let's take our time. <laughs> this game is so freaking cute! Come on, come on, come on. <laughs> I can just steal you. You can be my little buddy forever. Wee. Are you ready? I love him. I love him. Do you need to talk to me about something? I bought something recently, but it's just not for me. I thought maybe you'd like it though. Do you want it? A bubblegum tea. It's like you read my mind, Rosie. Thanks a bunch. Thanks for bringing me here. It was nice of you to show me the way. I'm gonna take off now. You two have fun together. My visitor took off, but I'm glad you're here. I've got a little gift for you to show you how grateful I am for your help. It's a stroller! Why am I getting a bunch of like baby items? Thanks a bunch. You really helped me out. <laughs> that was so fun. That was so fun. I really hope my villagers asked me to do hide and seek. You have no idea how fun that is. Doop, 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 doop. I'm gonna grab any fossils I see. Oops. I wanted to see the outfit that she gave him. I was kind of hoping he would change into it. But he didn't. What? It's been a week! I thought I was gone longer. The way y'all were acting. You know what? I should, um... 
I should try to find the money rocks, actually. I don't know why I haven't been doing that. Here, let's try this. It's not like my shovel's gonna break. Okay. <gasps> Boba's so good. I actually- it took me a while to find Boba that I like. And it turns out the key- The key was just that I didn't like milk Boba. I like, um, I like the green tea Bobas. So, I've had strawberry green tea, I've had plum green tea. Oh! I got silver. Those are always my favorites. I love the like flavored green tea ones with the like pearls in them. Oh, I love them, Lily. Those are my favorites. See, I don't like the popping ones. We're the opposite on that. I like them. I like chewing on them. I like chewing on those balls. Oh, there you go. There's a quote. <laughs> <laughs> I don't like the flavored ones either. I don't like flavored balls. I only like the regular balls. <gasps> a gyroid! A mega drilloid! Pete Davidson? Don't say Zeus has entered the chat. <laughs> not here so I didn't do much I was at the doctor's office really really fun wish I was anywhere else but there um, however my mom well actually Zeus did send me flowers which was really sweet um, so that was nice and then I sent him it was funny because he sent me flowers and then I was waiting for him to wake up because I was gonna like Uber Eats something to him, but I forgot that when it was Valentine's Day here, it was already the next day there. So it wasn't even Valentine's Day anymore. And I was like, oh, so like every, it was slim pickings, y'all, of what I could get him. I ended up getting him some, um, how do you pronounce it? Like Ferrer Ro Ro for, for those, what are they called? Ferrero Rocher? Those, those candies, they're like the fancy gold wrapping or whatever. He really likes those. I was able to get some of those delivered. Nailed it. Yeah. Slay. But it was funny because I had to wait for him to wake up. And then I also had to wait for stores to open. <laughs> like in Australia, because it was really early. So I was just kind of like, what's open? <laughs> Not much. It wasn't much. Oh! <gasps> Uh-oh! Uh-oh! I'm so annoying. I'm so sorry. My creepy neighbor gave me flowers. Like a full bouquet? I'm not even gonna tell you whose building that is. It's a surprise. Um, what was I saying? <laughs> oh, my mom got me some presents. 
She got me like some, she got me some of Paris Hilton's like kitchen line, like the cutting board and the little knives and scissors and stuff. They're all pink. And then she got me um, like, a, like a tiny little Lego set, but it has a husky in it. So she bought me it, which was cute. Then what else did she get me? Oh, some, um, my mom always gives me presents on Valentine's Day. It's really sweet. She got me some, um, like food prep, like ceramic airtight containers, but they were like really gorgeous and they were like very granny chic looking with like floral patterns on them. Cause I really like putting leftovers and fruits and stuff like that, like in those containers. I only put them in the fridge. Um, and I got her some cute, like, pink bookmarks and I also gave her some of those coloring like alcohol markers that I got because I actually I got those for myself and then I ended up upgrading to a bigger size so I gave those to her yeah and then we went out to eat Did you get an avocado? Well, I eat them every day. I consume like a lot of avocado, <laughs> like a weird amount. You got a ring and roses? Like a ring? Do you know what's really cute? Kayla got me, like Kayla, little Simsy Kayla, got me an avocado ornament from Croatia. And I was like, girl, that is, cr that's like so cute and sweet and also like perfect. Cause like my family is Croatian. My mom's from Croatia. And so like, and the avocado, I mean like two for two. She nailed it. It's so cute. I want to see what this looks like. <laughs> when will my husband return from war? <laughs> I don't want anything in here. She is Ellie. My boyfriend sent me a new mouse, coloring book, snackies, and a reversible plushie that shows when you're happy or grumpy. Oh my God, I've seen that. I love those. They're so cute. Got the grace, thank you for the sub. His name is Octodude. <laughs> is that a katana? It's purple. Oh, it's white. Thirty-six thousand bells. Are you freaking kidding me? In this economy, Tommy? In this economy? He just called me poor. How about this music stand? I'm just trying to upgrade the shop, so I want to buy stuff. You know what? I don't know if I can just give people gifts. But I can wrap them and... Mail them to them, I think. Ooh. Okay. Oh. <gasps> I never mailed my letters? <laughs> They've just been sitting in there? Dude, are you serious? Oh my God. Hello, I don't think I've ever been in here. Hello. There you go. Take it. Who should I give this music stand to? Should I 
She had some music in her house. Um... Can't wait for her to send me that later. Okay, wait. Let's wrap the music stand. I'm not sure I needed to wrap it. I just did it to be fancy. Shakespeare himself. Thank you so much for noticing. I have a really um, beautiful ability to write. Hey, Juwag, thank you for the 100 bits and for the gifted sub. Oh, I like her little pencils. Okay, goodbye. Ah, my water is hitting today. It tastes good. You have a way with words. Not a good one, but a way. <laughs> Are you guys seeing what I'm seeing? Thirty-nine thousand bells. Oh, here we go. Okay. Happy home designer. Happy home paradise. Look! <gasps> Double mermaid! <laughs> oh, this is gonna be like five grand. Oh, less than I thought. <laughs> Feral noises. Move! Frick! I'll be back. He's fully clothed in this game. He's very profesh. Yeah, <laughs> Lily. That was literally me just now. <laughs> I just didn't even know how to act. Do y'all remember the Gracie Grace sets from City Folk? That is in this game too, but it takes a long time to unlock Gracie, which I think is great. Gracie, really out there, be Grayson. Be Grayson my home with her fine ass furniture that costs a hundred grand per couch. It's so pretty. Okay, I wanna sell this. Ooh, I don't know about these. I'll sell the rest of these, I don't need them. I'm rich! Hello? Who's here? <gasps> Hello. Oh my gosh, Zeus loves Dr. Pepper. And if I'm being honest, so do I. But I don't drink brown soda. Which I know that might sound weird, but brown sodas have caffeine. And typically the clear ones don't. But I actually don't really drink soda at all anymore. If I do, it's a Sprite. Yes, the strawberry and cream one is delicious. <laughs> but I, I try and I don't have them much now. Sometimes I'll get a Sprite if I go out, but I don't go out that much, so it's not really that bad. I actually don't mind Pepsi from what I remember it tasting like. I don't think it's that bad. A lot of people really don't like it.
Oh, Pepsi Max is good. I remember liking that one. Oh, I forgot this is in center. That's gonna make me furious. Well, let me put down my widow's stroller. Oh my god, it's cute! There's a teddy bear inside. Look at the wheels! <laughs> cute. I want to see what these look like. Okay, that's really scary. <laughs> I don't like that one. I don't mind you. You can stay. I can't like put these out, can I? Put on ground. <laughs> Delightful. Mr. Pib? Bro. You know what? I'm like so curious, but I don't think they sell it anymore because someone died drinking it. Is the um, charged lemonade at Panera. It apparently had so much caffeine that it killed someone. They still have them. You actually need to stop. Someone died and they kept it. Three people. But it has like a ridiculous amount of caffeine in it. And like for, but why? But why do they need to put so much in? And then you get like free refills of it. It's weird. It's like four Red Bulls combined. That, that's so weird. You want a centipede? Girly pop. Oh, I think I have to hit a rock actually to get that. But I'm telling you, if I find one, it's mine. God, this game is so smooth. I was watching a video the other day of somebody talking about this game and they were talking about how fast and how smooth it is. Whereas like, New Horizons has a lot of animations that take a long time. Dude, I'm rich. I, just like that, I'm actually so freaking rich right now. I have $25,000 dollars Hmm, I'm wealthy. I, I have on like three shirts. My stomach itches. <laughs> oh, there's a picture of Tortimer in the back. How am I doing? 80%? Damn! Wait, that's crazy. I'm flying on that. We were at like 20% yesterday, which is wild. Oh, okay. Can I even get a centipede in the winter? Was that? That's a roly poly. And it's new. Let me find some more rocks. Maybe I can find one. Well, I have to find two, technically, because I'm going to sell the first one. Let's be serious. Also, I'm going to go down to the beach each. 
A lost item! Arnor! Ugh, oh, where are they? Dude, I actually have a lot of money now. Just all of a sudden. Mo one money rock, man. That's all it took. I should be hitting those every day. Oh, okay. That was my bad. My brain glitched out. I saw it and I go, what do I do? <laughs> well, rip. Actually... You know what? Well, you know what? There's a fish right here. I can try to get it. Oh my god, I'm going down the current. <gasps> new fish? New fish, new fish, new fish! Beep, boop, 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 beep, boop, beep. I haven't seen any lake fishies. They're rare. Ah! I'm waiting for someone to put something else on sale. All right, I would like to sell this and this and this and this and this. And one of these. And then I'm gonna keep the other two. Perfect. Thank you, sugar. Gotta go. Bye. I now that I think about it, I haven't been to Panera Bread, period, in so long when I used to go all the time. For some I had like a Panera kick one time. I was just going like every day. But now I've gone in like years. I don't know. I just stopped one day. One time you go to Panera and you don't realize it's gonna be the last time you ever go. Not even close. It can't be mine. See New Horizons, they tell you whose it is. Here, they keep you guessing. No, Panera's really good. I like Panera. I just stopped going for some reason. Uh, Bozalia, thank you for the six months. Halfway to a year. Oh. Not yours either, huh? Hmm. Ooh, I got some points. <laughs> wow. Uh, I thought I saw someone else up here. Was it you? Yeah, I haven't asked you. God, their voice is really loud. <laughs> POV, it's yours. Can you imagine? Oh! It's for Del Taco Free Shavakadoos. That's their full legal name. A deer shirt? This is not gonna be as cute as my cute dress. I hope that bumped me up to 100%. It's gonna be so ugly. Uh, it's not bad ugly, but it's not as cute as this. I haven't played Genshin in so long. I do still wanna play it on stream, like real bad. Uh oh. Stop talking to me, stop talking to me, stop talking to me. I need your honest opinion. You know how I say snacky a lot? Do you think I should find something else to say? You know what, I actually think it's cute. But I'm gonna say something else. What is she gonna say? What is gonna be her new catchphrase, guys? What should she say? Oh, girly pop is so perfect. All one word? Or two words? One word. Okay. 
Gaily pop. <laughs> oh, she is such a girly pop. You can expect me to say girly pop a lot. <laughs> I'm happy for you, girly pop. <laughs> I haven't heard anyone say girly pop in a really long time. <laughs> I think that one kind of died out. Oh, I need to go to the museum. Oh, I thought they were chasing after me for some reason. Brianna, thank you for the year! Appreciate that, thank you. I still say it? That's okay. Oh wait, I forgot we had a new villager. <laughs> I forgot. Oh shoot. I accidentally, sorry, I put my freaking controller down on my keyboard. <laughs> that scared me. This is Eugene. He likes espresso and he's a koala. It's literally just Zeus. Do you know what's cool forever? And that's you. Period. You cheat Krabs or nothing! Mr. Krabs is in there! Wait, Mr. Krabs is unfair! What the hell's a sink? Mr. Krabs is unfair. Krusty Krab is unfair! Mr. Krabs is in there! Standing at the concession! Planning his oppression. oppression! Got it, thank you. Thank you. Just needed to hear that. It's the Krusty Krab who's unfair! <laughs> Got it! <laughs> Did you see the Nick halftime show for the Super Bowl? No! But I think it was Sammy who told me they did, um, Sweet Victory. Which is awesome. And I, I would have much preferred to see that than Usher. No offense, Usher, but you cannot beat Sweet Victory. That might be one of the best songs ever sung. Ever. Oh, I should make that my tell too. That's a good one. Uh-oh. Oh, no. Oh, okay. I think I disconnected for a sec. Uh, not me, they give me the five months! <laughs> that command is funny. Victory screech! Dude, I've donated so many fishies. I got so many fishies in here right now. Oh wait, the Papa's people are making a new Papa's game. They've been working on it for a while. It should be coming out soon, I feel like. Let me go to their blog. Ugh. No announcement? They're showing sneak peeks. It's not fish and chips, it's... it's... Paletteria. I think I'm saying that right. Paletteria? It's like the ice... the like ice cream... Uh, oh my god, what's it called? Not an ice cream cone, a... Popsicle! Yeah, yeah. Hmm. It looks really, really cute, but I... I don't think they have a release date for it yet. <laughs> They're running out of names. I don't think they've announced a, a release date yet, though, which is really sad. Nobody in here yet? No fishies in this room. 
You know what I didn't realize? That the museum in New Horizons will develop scenery in the tanks the more fish that you donate. Like, there will start to be vines hanging over stuff, and... I mean, I noticed it a little bit, but they were just some I didn't notice before. A lot of... Look at that one freaking flat-ass fish! <gasps> oh my god! He's dead! They're just so flat! <laughs> They're like 2D! Body shaving. <laughs> I'm so flat. <laughs> so I can help it. <laughs> oh, it's too funny. <laughs> he's just like the. He's like when he when he goes like to the ground, he basically disappears. Dude, I got a big old stain on these pants. I don't know what they are. I don't know what that stain is or where it came from. I'm just gonna roll with it. Are they gonna do other Papa's Deluxe games? I don't know. I hope so. I loved them. Playing them on the PC was awesome. get all my upgrades now because I'm rich a fries pop a game would be like a different loaded fries isn't that like a Canadian thing Yeah, like poutine. Should I get the pink door too? I think yes. Oh yeah. What exactly is poutine? I know it's like loaded fries, but like loaded with what? It looks vile. Um, it's a dish of french fries and cheese curds, otherwise known as cheese turds, topped with a brown gravy. Nah, I'd fuck it up. <laughs> Actually sounds pretty good. <laughs> it looks really gross, but it, I, honestly, I would eat that up. <laughs> it is scrumdiddlyumptious. If I ever go to Canada, which I really want to, it's very strange that I haven't been to Canada seeing as I, like, I'm in the U.S. of A. Like, it's not that far. Um, I want to go. They have it at the Chicago Christmas Market. Ooh. I think I would be worried that I would try to get some in Canada and then everyone would be selling like really crappy poutine. Yeah, I'm like really close to Mexico. I could just walk on over. They have it at McDonald's in Canada? Are you serious? McDonald's Canada poutine. I want to freak out if this is true. Why would they sell it there? Oh my god, no they do. I would not get it from there. I would just trust me on this one. <laughs> it doesn't look good. I gotta actually close that image. <laughs> it's making me sick. <laughs> it's not good looking. I would love to get some poutine from a restaurant in Canada. Wendy's has it. Costco has it. I 
I mean, listen, I think McDonald's should just stick to what they know. Poutine at McDonald's seems crazy. It's like getting a salad from there. No, wait. Have you guys ever seen that thing from, uh, oh, is it Family Guy? Maybe? Where they like ordered a salad from like a pizza place? Hello? Hello? I'm just so used to having her on my arm, I didn't even notice. I was just like, ooh, my arm is warm. <laughs> Hello, Pookie. Hold on, let me see if I can find the video. It's pretty funny. I think it's Family Guy. Family Guy order salad from pizza place. Oh, yeah, yeah. They like make fun of how horrible they are. <laughs> how horrible they are. What are you doing? What are you doing? Actually, hold on, let me turn the volume down. Hi, honey. I'm gonna show them that pizza, f or no, wait, salad from Pizza Place is bad. Yeah. I know what you want, baby. Uh, yeah, I do, I do, I do, I know. I know what you want, I know what you want. I do, I'm very smart. Mommy knows. Yeah, you don't even have to tell me. Okay, we'll watch this. <laughs> That's not lemon! No, it's not. You bastard! I was having fun playing in the snow, and now you've ruined it like a pizza place ruins a salad! Okay, four pizzas and a salad. Salad? How do you make a salad? First, you throw in the whole head of lettuce. Even the hard-to-eat white part at the bottom? That's what the people want. Now, what else? I got a can of whole black olives. Should I slice them up? What are you, crazy? No, you keep them whole. You're gonna wanna know you've got an olive in your mouth. What about this tomato? Cut it into thirds. It should be big enough to pretend you've got red teeth. How about this carrot? Should I cut it up? Yes, but very thin lengthwise. The whole length of the carrot. One thin slice. Okay, what else do we got? Well, we got these hot peppers, but you can't really eat them. No problem. Dump them all in. Now, should we put it in a bowl? <laughs> no, let's put it in a lasagna tray. Okay, great. I'll take it. Oh, and make sure to stick it right on top of the pizza so it stays nice and warm. Hello, every pizza place. <gasps> <gasps> what was that? What was that image? <laughs> that was scared me. Anyways, whenever I think of salads, or whenever I think of stuff like that, it always makes me think of that. They're vile. The big chunk of tomato really gets me. Because I hate tomato. That makes me want a pizza, though. <gasps> I had a gluten-free pizza the other day. I think I told you guys. I actually can't remember what I tell you what I don't tell you. <laughs> is reading really all that fun? Of course it is. My current favorite book has to be Flex Your Muscle Memory. Oh, I didn't tell you? Oh, I'll get back to it in a sec. And before that, there was Giving New Life to Furniture. That one was great. And she said my next favorite was Akatar. <laughs> Just hearing those titles is making my brain hurt. Really? Well, there are all sorts of books, girly pop. <laughs> what about all those specialty food books? Hold on, food books? I wonder what they taste like, I wonder. You can't eat books. Your poor, poor coloring books. They're books about food, girly pop. Oh, well if I can't eat them, I'm not interested. Wow, Lucky, you really do have a one-track mind, don't you? That was a great conversation. <laughs> I hear you, girl. I hear you, girly pop. <laughs> uh, no, but I ordered, there's like a Italian restaurant that I've been to before. And it's, it's like a little local place. And they, I, I was looking on like the food delivery apps. This was a while ago when I had first started doing gluten free to see <laughs> what I could eat, you know, if I ordered out, not much. But this restaurant has like a full gluten free like section, which is cool. And they have gluten-free pizzas and a few pastas, which was pretty awesome. So finally I caved because I was feeling like a pizza and I got one and I gotta be honest, I don't know what the difference was besides the fact that the crust was like just thin. 
I mean, it tasted pretty normal to me. It was good. Yeah, Lily, that is that is annoying. Yeah, I assume it was cauliflower crust. It was good. I literally don't I don't know what the dif I, I couldn't taste the difference. So, I'm pretty happy about that. Oh, no, I'm supposed to be helping her with it. Eh. Gluten has no taste. I tried it by washing everything out of a dough? Wait, what do you mean by washing everything out of a dough? Wait, what does that mean? Gluten's a texture thing. Oh. Well, it didn't feel any different either. It was just thin. Okay. I'm gonna quit this. Gluten's what makes your dough rise. Fallen Angels, thank you for the nine months, by the way. 